There should be a climbing rope right over here somewhere. I'm hoping anyway, because now we got wolves on us. <laughs> we got wolves. Hello everybody, Grace still plays and we're back with more of the long dark hopeless rescue. No time for BS. We've got to drop some of the stuff that we have because we're carrying a little bit too much for our trek up this mountain and I want to make sure that we are not encumbered. I'm going to drop this hacksaw and I am going to drop one of these lanterns and that'll put us right where we need to be, which is good. All right, this is it, guys. We've got to get up this. We've got to get up this hill and get to that fuselage. And we've got to do it without getting bitten by wolves. As you can see, there's already a wolf just kind of hanging out. That is why they call it Timberwolf Mountain, after all. All right, let's see if we can kind of head up this way. Let that wolf go by. Ooh. Hmm. I might have an idea. I wonder if I can get this stag to run toward this wolf. And maybe I can get the wolf all pissed off at the stag. Go ahead, stag. Get over there. Come on, wolf. Get that stag. Oh, the wolf looks like he's interested. He looks like he's interested. Go get him. You don't want me. I'm tough and muscly with a whole bunch of insulation. <laughs> Man, it is negative eight degrees outside. There we go. That wolf just took that stag down. We'll check out that body maybe when we come back down. Maybe there'll be something good to eat. I've got a cup of coffee on me just in case we need it. Now, I'm not 100% sure what the best way up this mountain is. I believe it's kind of like a clockwise trail. So that's the way that we're going to go. I believe there's a few... How much time do we have left? God, two days left. Man, and I thought I was really trucking along too. I'm not sure we're going to have enough time for this. Now, I'm pretty sure there's a couple of climbing areas that you actually have to utilize as well. I'm not sure how steep... Yeah, we can't get up that way. All right, that's fine. We'll just keep going as best we can. We are going to have to sprint now and again. Get some time back. Uh, this looks promising. Only negative two degrees if I hug the, uh, the mountain like this. Uh, yeah, I think we can get up this way. Looking good. Just gotta hope there's no wolves on the other side. Man, that is a sheer cliff face. Um, but it worked. We got there. Holy crap, that's tall. How in the world do we get up that? All right, let's 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 continue to take a look around. Like I said, I think it's kind of like a, um, a clockwise continuance. Man, it's windy on this mountain. Still negative eight degrees. We've got a little bit of wood and such just in case we need to make a fire. You can hear all the creaking of the trees. Very freaky. I like it. Is there a rope anywhere here that we can use? No, there is not. That is just a sheer cliff face. How about over here? Gonna be doing a little wandering, guys. Because like I said, I'm not 100% sure exactly how you're supposed to... Ooh, can we get up this way? No, not at all. Well... Yeah, not at all. Keep moving around in this early direction. Try not to break all my limbs as I hop down. Got a bright, a brilliant blue sun out today, which is nice. But, oh, what is that over there? There's something over there. Is that a tent or something? Not 100% sure. I wonder if we can get down there without breaking our legs. Let's kind of hop down this way. Sprint on over. Keep one eye looking behind me at all times. Oh, there it is. 
I think that might just be a piece of the plane. Actually, that's kind of what it's looking like. We can see the tail right there. That is where we need to be. How tired are we from all this running around? Yeah, we're a little winded. We might actually be sleeping up there in the end. What do we got? We've got a man with a hacksaw. I do not want your hacksaw. If you have any food on you, though, I'll take it. Or maybe a soda. Okay, I guess you don't have jack crap. I think we've got a cardboard box. That does nothing for me. All right, let's continue onward. It is freaking freezing outside. Negative seven degrees. The winds are howling. And we found a couple of rare trees. Not that we can use them. But this is what you're looking for. If you guys are ever looking for, like, um, birches and uh, maple and stuff, this is essentially what you're looking for. These are maple saplings. But that's how you make your arrows and the like. Holy cow. The whipping winds are pretty damn brutal. How in the world do I get up this cliff face? Gotta be a way around here somewhere. Uh, and it is not that way. Okay. So, most likely back the way we came. Just check this area real fast just to see what it looks like. Nope, that's a dead end. So close, yet so far. Ooh, this might be a path up here. This is looking good. Getting tired though, getting tired real fast. In fact, let's go slurp down that coffee. Oh yeah, delicious ice cold coffee. Whatever, better than nothing, there we go. Give us a little bit of our stamina left. I'm gonna try and walk the rest of this. I'm burning up way too much energy using the sprint button, but man, I wanna get there as fast as possible. God, I hope this doesn't just end at a cliff face. Looking decent so far. Ah! Okay, we definitely haven't seen that before. Got to an engine now. Just gotta keep moving. If we're lucky, maybe there's something around this engine that we can utilize. And if we have to, those little engines and stuff are gonna be our... <laughs> They're essentially gonna be where we're gonna rest. Oh, what was that? A sprained wrist? Man. So I guess anytime you traverse uneven terrain, you always have a possibility of spraining something, which sucks. At least it wasn't our ankle. I do have pain pills if we had to use them too, but we really don't right now. We don't have a, a rifle or anything. Let's see, is there anything here? No. Oh, here you go though. Look at this. If you had to, you could sleep in here. Good to know. All right, let's keep heading around then. Spooky. Everything's dead quiet right now. Oh, little bunny! You're the first friendly creature I've seen besides that stag. Hello, little bunny. We gotta keep our eyes out for any kind of ropes, too. As I understand it, there are ropes here now and again. Ooh. A cave! Okay, now we have a secondary place to sleep if we had to. Let's see what's inside here. I imagine we're not the only ones who have found this cave. Oh, it's an actual cave that you can go inside. Uh, alright, I guess I'll look at it real quick. I don't want to spend too much time in here, though. How big is this cave? Uh, it's looking pretty damn big, actually. Man. A lot bigger than I had anticipated. Whoa. That's a little bit of a drop there. Alright, there's no time for that, guys. We've got to continue. No time for caves. Turn this out. Get this flare back going again. We've got four flares. That's pretty good. 
And we need to go to the right after we get out of this cave. I've got to see if I can continue to remember my way. Only negative one degree. That's not terrible. And the the world is dead, dead tired right now. Just a couple of flurries. That is so cool. Little flurries just kind of fluttering down. Real slow. Or what else do we have to do to get up this hill? There's a little little creek over here, it looks like, too. More engine parts? Yeah, that's something. Looks like there's a pathway over here, too. Alright, what do we have up by this pathway? Anything? Nothing. Another sheer cliff face. Man, I feel almost like I'm going in circles. Do you have a whole bunch of old man's beard lichen, though? I think I'm going to go ahead and grab this since we're not being chased and it's not like negative a million degrees outside. We can use this to make those uh, antibiotic dressings. Come here. I think we need three old man beard lichens in order to do that. I haven't seen any wolves either, so that's pretty good. I'm kind of getting disoriented though. Um, let's see. I think there is where we need to be. So we may have to go up this side. Let's take a look at what's past here. It's like a really, really tiny little pond lake thing that goes out to a uh, to a stream. It's, it's almost like there should be a little waterfall that was coming off of that. I don't know. Maybe, maybe that's what that is. I don't know, guys. Starting to feel totally lost. Oh, you know what we're going to need our uh, our wrist for is probably cl uh, climbing up any kind of ropes that we find. Man, where are we supposed to go? Show me the way. Because I'm not seeing jack crap right now. We just seem to be going downward. Uh, I almost feel like we've been here before. I definitely feel like we're heading downward, though. I don't like this. Maybe there's something this way. Hopefully I'm not just going around in circles. I don't necessarily remember seeing any of this, but it all looks, it all looks so much the same. Okay, so we do need to follow this wall all the way around to the back side of the, oh crap. Oh, there's a wolf right there. Let me see if we can go around this guy. And of course he's going in the exact same direction we're going, awesome. All right, whatever. That's okay. We can still do this. How are we looking? We're tired. We're chilled. We're getting kind of hungry. It's zero degrees outside. If we follow this river until it comes to a break, there's going to be a climbing area, and we have to go up that climbing area. I'm going to have to deal with this wolf. I'm not super happy about this. Maybe I can sneak past him. Nope, sure can't. Head on out there, buddy. There we go, good. And he's heading the exact same direction we are. That's awesome. Whatever, maybe we can get far enough past him to where he won't bother us. We do need to follow this river, though. Just got to keep following this river and looking to our right. Because apparently that is where the the rope will be. Now, when you light a flare, you actually get a couple degree bonus. If you notice, it is three degrees outside right now. There's also another cave entrance up here. I really don't want to go to sleep, though. Maybe we can just, like, rest for an hour or something and get a little bit of our strength back. All right. So here's the break. 
No, if they really? Come on, man. Give a guy a give a guy a break. Now, if this map serves correctly, there should be a climbing rope right over here somewhere. I'm hoping anyway, because now we got wolves on us. <laughs> we got wolves. I am not seeing a climbing rope. Man, I'm not seeing a whole lot of anything. Come on, this should be it. Did I miss it? Let's head on down here. Maybe I did miss it. Friggin' wolf. No way, man. Alright, guys. So here we are. I'm straight up lost. Um, I'm in a cave system. I think I'm somewhere still near the engine. I just can't figure out how to get the hell up the side of this mountain. It's a heck of a thing. If you guys have any suggestions, feel free to let me know in the comments section below. We've only got one day and 19 hours left, though. This is going to be tough to do. We are completely exhausted, so I'm going to have to bed down here for the night. Anyway, guys, hope you're enjoying the long, dark, hopeless rescue. Things are definitely looking hopeless. Until the next time, stay foxy and much love.